go ahead. Ah, oh, thank you for remembering its name. To explain it, I will need to tell you a really, really old story I once read in a picture book. Mm -hmm. So once upon a time, in a faraway seaside town, there lived a black and white bird. Since birth, it spoke with a stutter, walked with a wobble, and was unable to fly, so it was always bullied by the other birds. Until one day, greedy pirates, in a flash, lightning and thunder engulfed the, the black and white bird tried to leap upwards, but it still couldn't fly. In its recklessness, it cracked. The seabirds flying overhead thought it would drown right then and there. But to their surprise, it began to swim like the swiftest of fish. It swam and swam until its strength finally gave out. It restored the diadem to its rightful place underwater. And immediately, the storms died down. And it was as if nothing bad had ever happened. As you've probably guessed by now, the bird in the story was named Pear. It was a... <laughs> You're right. I've always admired the pear in the story, but after reading it, what struck me the most was... So I decided to stick close and hug Pear, so we can keep each other warm. trouble you to accompany me to a few places when you're free? I'd like to visit Le Pote aux Logeries, Beaumont Workshop, and the Vasari Passage. Mm-hmm. I'd like to take a look at their clockwork crafts, as well as the variety of small mechanisms they usually have to offer. I'm a regular of the shows, but whenever I pass by the other shops, I can't help but be curious. What lies hidden deep within those shops? What if there's something there that's both original and exquisitely designed? What I wouldn't give to be able to see everything for myself. If only... <sighs> see, I'm not very good at dealing with people. And if I spend a lot of time gawking at the wares without paying a single coin, I'm sure the shopkeepers would get mad at me. So, if you could step in at that point and help me. Yeah, something like that. I know it might be awkward, but... I'll pay you back, I swear. As long as it's something I can do. <sighs> Thank you so much. I'm... not dreaming.